Well, today went down and uh, got a new battery. Went down to Walmart actually, and um, this battery cost about 70 bucks. And as you can see, it's for a child's ride on toy. It is a 12 volt right there, so. I um, already got the old wires disconnected. That's my positive wire, and the black is the ground wire, so. Let's see if I just reach in here and pull this old one out. Just like that. There's the old battery. So I'm get the new one out. And there's the new one. Same battery. Let's take the old one and put it back in here. One thing about these batteries that has the positive and negative right there, so when you hook that up, you just gotta make sure you follow the right cable so you get the positive to the positive and the negative to the negative. So the connections that I used were these things here. One wire goes through there. These little metal clips right there. I don't know if you can, there we go. It cuts through the, uh, the outer protective shield on the wire and goes hits the metal on the inside so you can see this one here cut through the wire and that's what those marks are there so we'll put the new battery back inside here which goes right down inside there and reattach these and uh, see what happens so for safety we uh, Took some of that electrical tape, covered up those um, bearings. Didn't need it like touching together and shorting out or anything. So, and that's it. So, there's look for your ground side, which is this side here. I'm just going to take that and put it right inside. Got to open it up a little bit. Slide it down. And put it right there. So, take a little bit of oomph here to make it happen so get pliers let's get a little squeeze here cut through the wire and there it is this guy wrap it over I'll grab a piece of tape that one. Now the positive. Get it right next to him. There it is. Get my pliers. In there, good. There we go. Put a piece of tape around it. Alright. Touch this 
wire over here. Well, it should be good. Um, I'm just going to turn it on, see if we got, nope. and we got a good connection, so. Now what I'm going to do, take my charger. This is the, the charger for it. You'll get a amber light here. When it's uh, not fully charged, but when it becomes fully charged, it'll have a green light. So, you can connect, snap it together. Says we already got a green light, so we'll see. I mean, it might be come charged already, so. But we're just gonna let it sit overnight, anyways, and um, see what happens.